it looks like Microsoft understood something about the nature of their partnership with OpenAI. Because uh, last week on 28th of August, uh, they published two of their in-house models. And uh, these are uh, models uh, for uh, voice generation, for the, let's say, text-to-speech generation and uh, the large language model. They called it uh, MAI, so Microsoft AI. And uh, it's, it's actually very interesting because it's the first time Microsoft is publishing, uh, publishing something. Uh, before that, they were using uh, the models from, uh, from OpenAI. So it was, uh, so if you don't know, if you're using Copilot, uh, Copilot in the background is using uh, ChatGPT models because they have the partnership mm -hmm. with OpenAI. And uh, it was always like that. Uh, there was uh, um, on the background these models. But now what's currently happening, Microsoft is announcing uh, these two new models. And uh, by the way, all the links will be provided in the description. Uh, if we're speaking first about the uh, text-to-speech model, uh, it is actually quite, quite interesting, uh, quite interesting model. And you can already test it uh, for free. Uh, they're telling that uh, this model is uh, quite uh, efficient uh, because you can generate one minute of uh, audio uh, with only one second of uh, one GPU um, in play. So basically, it's, uh, it's really, really efficient. And um, you can generate just, uh, let's say, speech uh, when one person is speaking or it can be also a multi-person speech like a podcast, something like uh, Google LM. And another thing uh, is this uh, second model, which is a large language model, uh, MAI Preview 1. They already testing this model. It's not yet available, but they are uh, testing this model on, uh, on the leaderboard LM Arena. And uh, again, if you check the link in the description, you will be able to see that this model is currently ranking number 15. Uh, among various models in this little leaderboard if you have never seen it uh, please check it because it's very interesting you'll be able to see that uh, top i think eight places are the proprietary models like from models from Op open ai from anthropic uh, from from um, x ai so grok is there and uh, the models which are open source they are a bit lower ranked and the microsoft's model this first model provided by microsoft published by them uh, or let's say announced by them uh, last week is currently on the place 15 which is not bad to be honest uh, for the first trial and uh, i'm sure that they're going to be more and more models uh, what's interesting here is that uh, it looks like microsoft understood that in the partnership i would say in any business partnership uh, it's good to rely on your partner but at the same time maybe it's better uh, to also feel your own strength to be sure that if anything uh, uh, adverse happens you have your own resources this strengthens not only you uh, and not only partnership but uh, in general the relationship uh, between two parties.